Hey guys, what's going on? It's Dan, and I am back with a new season of the GLDL. We are going up against Water Warrior today, who is one of our Unite friends, who it's their first season of Draft League. Uh, but they've got a very solid, fundamental knowledge of Pokemon, so we obviously can't take this match easily. I do think that the Trick Room mode looks pretty good here. Um, Ferrigarath lead should be safe into most of what the options are here. And I think we'll bring the Raging Bolt as well. Uh, Enamorous is huge in the back. And the question is, do I want the Scizor or the Araquanid? There's a lot of things that resist water on this team. Uh, maybe being able to close off with some priority from the Scizor is going to be better than the Araquanid this first game. No Intimidate either, so the Clear Amulet's not a huge thing. So this Life Orb Scissor is going to be outputting a lot of damage. Uh... Yeah, let's try this first, but uh, good luck, have fun to water. Um, this team I drafted, it obviously doesn't look like one of my normal teams. I drafted a team specifically to try to make uh, it be a team that Ryan would want to play, which is why I've got two giraffes and uh, an Araquanid on this team. Uh, but yeah, let's dive on into this match with water now that he's all locked in. First, we'll see this uh, trainer card matchup where I'm sure I'm going to get absolutely trounced because my trainer card is still uh, the normal one in this in this uh, copy of the game. Yeah, that Lugia in the background is cool. And then, okay, so he is going for a very offensive mode here. Um, I think I can just set Trick Room. I'm not going to... Terra because I Terra Water and I don't want to eat a Grass type attack there. So let's just set Trick Room. And I think I can get a free Calm Mind up here. I get the double Giraffe lead and Thundering Dome is just so much bigger than Furry Giraffe. Uh, and yes, that is the proper name for Raging Bolt is Thundering Dome. But let's see what happens. Trick Room feels like a pretty solid lead here. Okay, and he's coming with Terra early. What are we dealing with? Dark type. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Oh, is this going to be a Terra Dark Pulse? That would be very cool. No, we can storm. I'd eat that all day. And if it drops speed, we're fine with that. Yeah, because we're setting Trick Room here. This should have killed. That killed? Okay, we're in a lot more trouble than I thought. Uh, without the plus one that killed. Okay. Interesting. Let's get... I think the Enamorous is going to be in a decent position here. So, that killed. That killed, that killed, that killed. Okay, so if I've got my Ferrigarath, and that is um, Ramblegast, Power Whip. That's almost got to be Bandit or some kind of boosting item because it's not Life Orb. So I think here, just clicking Moonblast here, and let's go for a Dragon Pulse here. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so it's not banded. It just hits really hard, okay. So this is fine, that's gonna, yeah, take it to Sash. And since there's no Sash on this thing, uh, Moonblast probably kills. Yep. Okay. So let's see what comes out next. Uh, 
I think I want to get one more round of leftover healing to make sure I survive that Bramble Cast attack. Which is not necessarily something I thought I'd be saying. Thing hits like a truck. I can kind of ignore it though, is the nice thing. So I think I want to Terra Steel here, and then we'll Earth Power. And... Can I just Thunderclap this Bramble Guest? I think so. Yeah, yeah, that should work. I've sort of got the Bramble Guest pinned, and I've got a lot of priority offense on this team. Looks like Rain didn't come this game, which means Del Fox might be in the back. Okay, that's fine. And here comes a Steel or a Poison attack into the... Oh, High Horsepower. Okay, that's annoying. If it is Del Fox in the back, uh, I'm going to be a little annoyed. But we have the Scizor now. which with bullet punch what am I attacking here I don't know if that bullet punch almost certainly kills so let's do another earth power into this slot and flip the bullet punch What are we getting here? Ground type attack. Ooh, temper. This is super cool tech. Okay. So we're gonna be in a one-on-one -on -one in the end with something. Okay, uh, let's see if an Ambrose can win a one-on-one. -on -one. This is Del Fox. I might have some issues. If it's one of the water types, I'm feeling pretty good. So it is the Delphox. Okay, this is not great. But it's not the worst thing ever. Let's see. I think I just... I gotta survive two attacks and take Earth Power twice. Oh, okay, that was a mistake, I think. Because Earth Power should still... Ah, Okay, same math. Ah, uh, is it the same math? I might need the special defense drop. Oh, okay, so this thing's super bulky. Okay, so he'll beat me game one. I'm shocked that thing killed me. Unless I get a crit here. Oh, and it seals the assault vest. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's very cool. Okay, he'll beat me game one. So the hard trick room lead doesn't work. Well, not that it doesn't work. Uh, it kind of doesn't work, but I think that means the Jugulus lead is better. Hmm. Light Scream Mystical Fire. Okay, let's go with the Jugulus lead.
What do I want to lead with the Jugulus? Raging Bolt? The thing has Temper Flare and Stomping Tantrum. It might be AV. Yeah, it's gotta be AV because it survived an Earth Power. Hmm. He went for a lot of low accuracy moves last time, but I think Jugulus is still a good lead here. Another Jugulus Scissor or Jugulus Raging Bolt? Jugulus Scissor. Raging Bolt's still really good in this matchup, and I still think I want the Enamorous. I can leave the Ferrigarath. Because if I can... Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Yeah, I forgot the thing had Temper Flare. Very cool. I should have assumed the, the Del Fox was in the back the way he was playing and used the Terra differently, but it's all fine. Okay. So he goes with the same lead. We've got it changed up a bit here. I can theoretically just get a uh, tailwind off here pretty comfortably. And I think I go for the knockoff immediately. Yeah, I'm very bulky here, which is good. Doesn't work on dark types. Yep. Little bits of game knowledge to pick up. Okay. I think Snarl makes the most sense here, and then I still knock off this slot. Is it going to turn dark? Ice. So this thing's got an ice move? It could be Ice Terra Blast. That's cool. So it goes to plus one. This could kill me. Oh, it doesn't have Wind Rider. What's its other ability? Yeah, that had Wind Rider, I die. Infiltrator. Okay, interesting. That's probably a mistake in team building. So what, it's gotta be the Revivrim here probably? And I assume it's AV. I can 1v1 this Tornadus late game. Yeah. We assume it's AV. We'll get that pretty much confirmed here. So I'm gonna Earth Power it. And then... Knock it off, probably, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, I think it's gonna be confirmed AV here. It'll almost certainly kill the Iron Jugulus. Oh no, it just went straight to the system. Okay. That's fine. We get Earth Power. We can just Earth Power that slot again.
I think we earth power that slot. And I feel like a Terra Electric Thunderclap here. I think this is very safe. Because I know it doesn't have Terra anymore. Yep, Jugulus is good. Terra Electric Thunderclap should get the kill. Yep. And then Earth Power will pick it up. I still don't know for sure if it's AV, but like, that's AV. So my Tailwind is gone. Do we reset the Iron Jugulus here? Or do we try and quick Tailwind? Uh, let's try and click. Okay, let's go for Tailwind and Calm Mind because we can't do anything that deals with both, both of these effectively. Okay, that's very cool. Psychic Terrain, Mystical Fire, okay. So Psychic Terrain, Mystical Fire, Light screen. So this tailwind's gone now. We can start snarling everything down. And can't drag, can't thunderclap, but can dragon pulse. Okay, game three time. Okay. Let's see, what do I want to do now? Jugulus is also decent against the rain mode. The Jugulus Scizor seems fine into a lot of this team. Maybe the play is Jugulus Raging Bolt. Good jugular scissor. I think I've got some more tech that I can play with that. Uh, I have to assume the rain mode comes, which Enamorous is really good with. Okay, so if it's just a hard rain lead. We do see the Kingdra though. I almost want to use my Terra right away on the Jugulus to make sure I don't get beaten down by something dumb. Gotta get the Tailwind up. Do I take the time to Sword Stance here? Um, would, at plus two, would I kill a Tornadus? Yeah, at plus two, I'd probably kill Tornadus. But if I bullet punch it, 
Yeah, I think I bullet punch. Okay, we're getting tailwind up. There's the Politoed. And I get to click Snarl. Apologies for the dog. He's on my lap. He's choosing now to be a time to leave. So the rain came. It's not going to do a lot. That did more than I thought it would. Yep, and this is why we care. Oh, I would have lived that. Cool. I know it's like a Good. I thought it might be. Gotta let my dog out of the room. One sec. Go. Okay. And now I get to... I mean, I could hurricane, but I get to start snarling, I think. Snarl knockoff seems really good here. Okay, that's fine. I still get to snarl. Now... Let's see what this Politoed set is. Politoed's got a lot of options. It also is high to Ah, the crit. Okay, well I get Springtide Storm. Snarl to reduce damage, and we click Springtide Storm. Because Rain is up. Yeah. That probably eats it better than anything, but it still doesn't love it. I don't even think he gets a... Well, he might get a Tailwind up. Attack ball is great. Attack drop, we take those. I think we go Earth Power and Springtide Storm. Let's see what the terror is here. Flying! Oh, that's cool. Okay. So this will live another turn, then. And minus one isn't going to do anything, is the question. Every inaccurate move hits. <laughs> I thought it was 100% accurate in rain. Am I... Am I missing something here? Uh, I guess that's the one of the three that isn't 100% accurate in rain. Okay. So we snarl. That's annoying. How many turns do I have speed still? don't right now, so I've got to set Tailwind again. Maybe get the Raging Bolt in? Yeah, I could live that. Please let me get the Tailwind off here. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Dunk shot. 
He gets the, I get the avoid. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. So now I go for my own hurricane here. For hurricane thunderclap. I think I hurricane thunderclap. Okay, the Politoed, it's not going to be able to reset the rain anymore. This is great. And then Hurricane sh Double Up should do it. Okay. Yeah, I guess it has Tailwind and Rain Boost. Let's see, what's my out here? The Rever Broom's gotta die. This last turn of Tailwind, which is annoying. I, pro I think I might just need to dodge a gunk shot here, or... And that's damn Brock. I think this gives me the most possible outs. Yeah, this gives me the most possible outs because I could get the confusion. Could get the confusion, could get the miss. Okay, I get the confusion, that gives me another out. I just need it to hit itself or miss the attack. I didn't either of those. Uh, hmm. Okay, so my out is having that confusion take effect and then giving a confusion on the poly this turn. Need that need to confuse. Okay, so I've gotten out here. Hurt yourself. Ah, okay. <laughs> I had my out. Yeah, good games to water. Uh, very well played in your first set. Uh, looking forward to the rest of the season. But thanks so much for watching, and I will be back next week, guys. See you later. Bye.